Good morning, Christine Ross. And this is still an, an ongoing attempted murder investigation. And like you mentioned, that teenager who's still in a critical condition at this point, a 15-year-old boy, he was found with two gunshot wounds, one to the hand and one to his lower body. And there was also another two victims involved who are also transported to the hospital. And this is still ongoing, but at this point, what we know is that there was a graduation type of event here at the Blaisdell Center. From what people are telling me this morning, as they're coming by through this area, it was called the Youth Challenge Graduation Event. And after that event, a little bit after nine o'clock, a 21-year-old man started to uh, fire a couple rounds at one of the victims. After that moment, he, he then took off from the scene and a witness started to chase after him. And as a witness was, was chasing the shooter, he was then assaulted by two other men. So in total, three arrests were made. Yeah, a 21-year-old man for attempted murder, an 18-year-old man, and a 17-year-old boy for assault. And again, three people were transported to a nearby hospital. So it does sound like a lot of commotion took place, and we were actually here when it shortly uh, when it happened shortly after. And go ahead and take a listen to some of the reaction we got from last night. We thought it was fireworks at, at like first, but then um, we saw people running, so we we're like, oh, gunshots. So again, three people have been transported to a hospital. Three people have been arrested. And if there are any developments moving forward, we'll keep you up to date first in our future newscast. But you can head over to our website at khwin2.com where you can grab the latest on what we have so far. Reporting out here at the scene, Dallas Navarro's KH2 News, working for Hawaii.